welcome back to my channel. I have hat hair because I just did the Therabox video because I just couldn't wait. And I received the same day that I received Therabox, I received one of my other favorite boxes, Crystal Council. Super excited to open this up and see what's inside. So let's get to it, shall we? Okay, we have Crystal Council, the Crystal Council, which is a monthly crystal box. It is, I don't know, $30 a month, $29 a month, $28, something like that. $25 a month maybe with tax, not tax, uh, shipping. Anyways, I never write these things down to tell you guys how much I pay. I know I pay $87 every three months for this sucker. That's what I pay. So... That being said, Crystal Council is a monthly subscription box that sends crystals. They send you a little survey on the first of the month that says, hey, what do you want to concentrate on in the following month? What are some things that you'd like to manifest into your life? And you fill it out and they pick four or five stones and a, throw in a little um, manifestation meditation tool to help you through the month. And then you get this in your mailbox every month around well this one's running a little bit late but um usually it's like the second week in the month that we get it so anyways let's jump in and see what we got here's what happens when i open the box so it looks like the first thing we've got here is the 2021 moon phase calendar And inside, it tells us when the full moons are through the entire year and what that moon is called, which is kind of neat. So for instance, January 28th will be the wolf moon. February 27th will be the snow moon. March 28th is the worm moon. Interesting. We have a pink moon on April 27th, a strawberry moon on June 24th. Then every month they send um, their little newsletter and it says dear subscriber the month for holiday cheer is here Although the season has a new feel to it. The uplifting emotions that come alongside are still here Colorful lights decorations and positive vibes Even if you aren't one who celebrates Christmas Everyone is positively affected by this time of year, but let me ask you a question Why do these positive energies reach this high of a level in December? Why can't we have a holiday cheer every day and year? I'd like to know the, the, the answer to that. The love, charity, and generosity that we all see is amazing. It brings us together not only as family and friends, but also as strangers. We at the Crystal Council challenge you to keep the love you provide during the holiday season as we advance into the new year. Don't let the end of the holiday season bring you back to normal. We want holiday cheer never to stop. We're ready to go. Are you? On the back, they tell you what the extra things. So besides the crystals, the crystal, the description of all the crystals will be in here. But they always include on the back side their little meditation tool or their extra that they sent. They always share it here, what it is. So share a crystal with a friend. One of your exclusives this, this month is a handmade crystal carrying satchel. We worked with a small business in Tibet that helps employ local villagers to craft these beautiful bags. Inside, we've included an extra stone. Red Jasper is a grounding crystal that helps connect you deeper with Mother Earth. Either keep the crystal for yourself or share it with a friend who you think could use its energies. So here's the, the little bag. Fantastic little bag. I love the colors on it. And inside is... I already have red jasper, but inside is this lovely red jasper. Pretty, isn't it? Not sure who I'm going to give it to yet, but I will figure it out. Hello, Chris. Winter is the time when darkness outweighs light. When the days are short and the weather changes, try not to let those external factors change your attitude or behavior. Seasonal depression is very much an issue, but what people forget about is that their perception matters most. 
This darkness is conjured by Mother Nature to allow you to reflect and look within. Embrace the negative thoughts and transmute them into a positive reality. Use the tools included inside to help guide you there. This month, we've crafted your box around luck, good fortune, communication with higher realms, strength, and balance. So here's what is in the box. First one we have is pyrite. Pyrite I have, but I don't have one that's this polished. I have one that's a little bit more in raw form. This one is really pretty looking. Pyrite is also called fool's gold. Um, pyrite boosts one's mental clarity and focuses it on all matters relating to assertive action. It awakens that inner warrior that will pursue any opportunity within your sights. This stone attracts abundance and power while helping to guide you in the direction of great prosperity. We recommend carrying this stone in your pocket daily. Will do, absolutely. The next one on here is the blue aventurine, which is this guy. Because it's blue, I'm guessing that's it. Blue aventurine is a psychic activator and helps one open up their third eye or pineal glands. This process doesn't just hope happen overnight, as one must work with this stone repeatedly in order to fully tap into its interdimensional potential. Place this stone over your third eye during deep meditation sessions, and you will begin to feel a tingling sensation. This effect will start at your forehead and slowly begin to imbue your whole body. The energy you're experiencing during this time is here to help relax your physical body while elevating your consciousness to new heights. That's really interesting. I don't have a stone that does that works like that yet. Okay, the next one we have here is garnet. Garnet, many of you may know as a gemstone, a dark red gemstone. So we have included a garnet that activates our root chakra, connecting us to earth. So this is perfect because I just also received the Earth Star Chakra Balancing Box um, that is all about using the, this next um, month to balance that chakra and to uh, bring about more grounding, which is what that chakra is based on. So Garnet would be another good stone to use in the meditations in working around that with the items that came in that box. So. Everything just, you know, kind of comes together, doesn't it? So at first sight, it may look rough around the edges, but after getting to know this piece, you'll see the true beauty within it. It's relatable to meeting a stranger, and after spending time with them, realize who they really are on the inside. Garnet will bring a vast amount of opportunities. Don't be afraid to take advantage of them. And then the last stone we have here, and the only reason I think or I know this is the Shiva Lingam, is because I know Shiva Lingam is, has this shape and kind of some of these colors because it's a very similar color to Garnet. I know it also polishes up into this, this shape. So Shiva Lingam aids in understanding the polaric energies such as light and dark or spiritual and physical. It helps bring total opposites together in perfect harmony, thus causing one to feel complete balance when grasping this stone. Meditating with Shiva Lingam will help balance the mind, especially with strong, overwhelming emotions. This stone helps promote prosperity and joy into any household it's placed in. Okay, so that's what we've got. We've got the little Tibetan satchel, which I'll use for carrying my pyrite around with me everywhere. We have garnet. Shiva Lingam and the Blue Aventurine and of course the Moon Phase Calendar. So there we go. The Crystal Council box for December. What did you guys think? Interesting stones in this one. They're not super flashy stones um, and yet they're very interesting stones and I kind of really like that. You guys know what to do now. Give us a thumbs up, leave me a comment, let me know what you thought about these stones. And of course, if you have not done so yet, please subscribe to the channel and have yourselves a fantabulous day.